And it's a girl, Daisy. Get your mother. Oh. Get your mother. And there's the birthday girl. Cheese. <laughs> Good morning, Maryville. It's a cold start to the day right now, only 21 degrees. Audrey was one of my only true friends. She was always a happy kid, fun kid. And Daisy, she was such a daddy's girl. In a small town, everybody is connected. A lot of these families have been here for generations. This guy started texting me. It was kind of like, oh, older boys want to hang out with us. I think I was drunk. <laughs> the boys were pretty persistent. Then I guess things got worse. She was laying in the yard, and her hair was frozen to the ground. A group of boys crowded around, looking at a phone. You carried her upstairs, passed out. Why did you lie to the police? She said, I'm scared. I did something that I didn't want to do. Who took the video? The whole town split up into sides. Daisy against people that were very, very vicious. We started having issues with vandalism. It was picked up in the world of social media. That's when this erupted into a firestorm. The grandson of a Missouri official has walked free. We had our house burned down. These are very hard cases. No nice way to say it. They're liars. The verdict was hard to believe. She said, I can't do this anymore. more important to shield the boys than it did to find justice for the girls. Try this trick and spin it. Girls have as much culpability in this world as boys do. Your head will collapse, but there's nothing. If no one's gonna talk about it, then I will. Where is my mind? It's sad, but after that Where incident, something clicked. We can't ignore an army of voices. The words of our enemies aren't as awful as the silence of our friends.